in the future days that we seek to make the cure, we look forward to a world founded upon four essential human freedoms. The first is freedom of speech and expression. And illegal Everywhere in the world. Smuggle in, hunker down, the second and wait to be legalized. It's freedom not gonna work out. of every moral compass based on our founding documents and the rule of law. We do that by putting America first because if we are sick, we cannot help ourselves. Introduce to you the President elect of the United States of America, Donald Trump. For Trump on the state, impacting millions and millions of working class people, where all of these economic gains pass them right by. I say it is time for us to come together as one united people. It's time. I am free to worship nothing at all. I'm free to be whatever I want to be. I want to be free to walk anywhere, any place, any time. I don't want to be excluded from a neighborhood. I want to feel safe on any street. I want access to nature all the time. I have the freedom to protest and voice my opinion. I'm free to express my opinions about anything that I think is unfair or unjust. I'm free to have whatever political views I like. Hi, I'm free to be who I am and to be in love with whatever person I want, girl, guy, it doesn't really matter. I'm free to honestly be myself. Uh, I'm free to speak out again about my political beliefs. I'm free to advocate for net neutrality. I'm free to live the way I want and be who I am. I'm free to express myself creatively through many forms of art. 
whatever my mood takes me. <laughs> I'm free to say what I want. I'm free to speak against the president and the freedom of speech is my birth given right. I'm free to practice my religion without repercussion. I'm free to rock my natural hair. I'm free to make sure that nobody feels fear in my classroom. I'm free not to live in fear. Uh, I can express my ideas without any kind of interference, without any kind of repercussions or any kind of uh, fear from anyone else. And that gives my, that brings my freedom out. I am free to prepare my middle school arts students for a future in which they'll participate as full citizens, whether male or female. I'm free to travel and enjoy my retirement. I'm free to be a Roman Catholic. I'm free to choose who and how to be. I'm free to choose the job I want to work. I'm free to love, love who I wish to love. I'm free to be a partner with the person of my choosing. And it hasn't been told to me that I have to be with somebody. And how lucky am I to have that freedom because that's what brings me my happiness, my partner, who I love and get to spend time with, and we hope for eternity. I'm free to speak my mind. I'm free to communicate my beliefs. I'm free to speak out for science education. I'm free to speak out. I'm allowed to advocate for women's rights. I am free to make art. I'm free to share my beliefs regardless of what anyone thinks about them. I'm free to encourage my students to value their own thoughts and opinions. I love to have freedom from wants. Physical things, material things, relational things, the total freedom you achieve when you are not attached to your car, your house, your clothes, as well as your relatives, sad to say, but if you are not attached, to your friends, your family members, your diseased relatives, you really, really feel that the way God created you, you have that ultimate freedom from everything. I am free to say just how I feel and what I believe in to anybody and anything and not feel any repercussions. I can free to express my, like, my opinion. I'm all for freedom of religion. I'm free to voice my dissent against government policies. I am free to speak my mind. I'm free to raise my amazing daughter to be an empowered young woman in charge of her own body and her own choices. I'm free to be economically independent.